Hi friends, I've brought a new video for you. This video is going to be on Epival CR. Epival CR is made by Abbott Pharmaceuticals. Epival CR contains Divalproex sodium, which is valproic acid, 500 milligrams. The box has 50 tablets in it, and the price for one box is 875 rupees. Valproic acid is used alone or with other medications to treat certain types of seizures. Valproic acid is also used to treat mania, episodes of frenzied, abnormal, excited mood in people with bipolar disorder, manic depression disorder, a disease that causes episodes of depression, episodes of mania and other abnormal moods. It is also used to prevent migraine headaches but not to relieve headaches that have already begun. Valproic acid is in a class of medications called anticonvulsants. It works by increasing the amount of certain natural substances in the brain. Valproic acid comes as a capsule, an extended release tablet, a delayed release tablet, a sprinkle capsule, etc. This one is a controlled release tablet. Take valproic acid at around the same time every day. Take valproic acid with food to help prevent the medication from upsetting your stomach. Follow the directions on your prescription label carefully and ask your doctor or pharmacist to explain any part you do not understand. Take valproic exactly as directed. Do not take more or less of it or take it more often than described by your doctor. Swallow the regular capsules, delete release capsules and extended release tablets whole. Do not split, chew or crush them. You can swallow. Uh, the sprinkle capsule whole or you can open the capsule and sprinkle the beads they contain on a teaspoon of soft food such as an apple sauce or pudding. Your doctor may start you on a lower dose of valproic acid and gradually increase your dose. Valproic acid is also sometimes used to treat outbursts of aggression in children with attention deficit hyperactivity disorder ADHD, more difficulty focusing or remaining still or quiet than other people who are the same age. Talk to your doctor about the possible risks of using this medication for your condition. This medication is sometimes prescribed for other uses as well. Ask your doctor or pharmacist for more information. Some side effects of this medication include drowsiness, dizziness, headache, diarrhea, constipation, changes in appetite, weight gain, back pain, agitation, mood swings, abnormal thinking, uncontrollable shaking of a part of the body, problems with walking or coordination, uncontrolled movements of the eyes, blurred or double vision, ringing in the ears and hair loss. I hope you like the video, please like and share our channel, subscribe to our channel, thank you.